are you trying to do there? I'm not trying to do anything. I'm trying to just get a get acquainted here so I can actually help you. Cool. Welcome back to Super Mario Galaxy. It's my turn. All right. We're going to hit up the last star of Golden Leaf Galaxy. Yeah, I think we'll be done with the engine room then, won't we? Uh, no. No? No. 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 What do you mean, no? Very no. Very no. See, uh, what you need to learn, my friend, is we basically have to clear every star for the rest of the prankster comets to show up. So we need to beat this one in order to unleash two more prankster comets. But it didn't say that there were any more prankster comets. Oh, because they don't show up till you finish they the galaxy. They don't show up till you finish the galaxy. Yep, you need to finish the galaxy in order for the rest of the prankster comets to show up. Hey, look at that L. L is real. I'm taking a big L right now. Oh. What the hell is a big L? A big loss. Oh. Please don't put an image of lost on the screen. Thank you. Or loss. Excuse me. A ain't no memes in this place. Everybody loves loss. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Oh. Well, I guess you, you know what we need to bring about this time. Human and nature will never cross! <laughs> there we go. Now we're a bee. Now we are a bee. Now, the bee suit is not waterproof. Which means we need to be very careful when going into the water. Well, how about we don't go into the water? That sounds like a bad thing to do. Okay, let's not go into the water, then. Oh, shit, I need to go this way. Towards the water. Well, go to the water! I'll go to the water. This is I'm the going to the water! I'm getting that, that gun, Josh Don damn You go to the water, you're gonna get wet! You get wet, you ain't a bee no more! You ain't gonna be bee no more? You ain't gonna be no bee! Bee no bee no bee no bee. You're a bee has been! Oh, that was pretty good. A has bee? A has been. Beans. Ah, <laughs> bee beans. Oh, this might be bad. This might be bad. Uh, uh, this might uh, be bad. Uh, uh. This might be bad. Uh, now we're fine. Just watch the shadow. Just keep an eye on the shadow. Mm-hmm. I'm just gonna fly through this stage. I hope you don't mind. You'll wing it. Literally and figuratively. Oh, I can still uh, ramp out. Awesome. All right. Bee time. Bee. Now, uh, there's, yeah, there's a lot of wetness around here. Oh, like that rain cloud that's... Gone. Gone? Yep, just phases out of existence. That's why they have these little divots here, so you can watch out for them. Uh-huh. Uh-oh. Ah! Okay. Yeah! That's what's up! Right just before the rain came. Mm-hmm. There's oh. another one coming. I'm ready. I'm ready. You got it. You got it. Very high-functioning bee. Ass-beakers. Ass... <laughs> well, I mean, I wasn't gonna go there, but... Yeah, let's just skip that part. <laughs> there we go. It's easy to skip with the bee suit. Hurry, hurry up. There we go. Oh, wait, what? Oh, I got you. I got you. I got you. We, fi we figured this out. He's got it. Uh-huh. Well, let's just uh, wait for this to happen, and then uh, off we go. Whoa. Lost time. Oh. Hey, you remember when you did this? Oh, now he's shooting bubbles. Yeah, here, here it is in a non-threatening way. I hope, I hope you don't mind. I took the easier one of the two. That's, that's okay. Hey, look at that. I'm kind of glad I took the harder one because, you know, it, you get a spring suit and everything. You can take the bee suit, which I'm not really a big fan of. I think the bee suit's okay. I mean, it's it's alright, I guess. Oh! But, well, safe for that. Well, uh, I guess we have to do this a different way. I'll, uh, I'll just wait for you to stop shooting. Hey, look at that, I made it. What? No, no, no! <laughs> <laughs> you didn't even need the bee suit for this guy. But there were spikes everywhere! Yeah, uh, spikes everywhere, but unfortunately there's a nice, jumpable wall there. Excellent. I spent so many thousands to make the platforms move! Sorry, Nintendo, it kinda ruined your design. Oh, Sorry! Man! That wasn't even from, like, speedruns or anything. I was just goofing off one day while doing that star in my own time. I was like, oh, I can, I can do this! Awesome. And now, increased. now the prankster comments start showing up. It didn't like right there. Okay. Well, I knew there was one there, oh, so I like this one. Okay, you can have that one. This one's all right. You, you you can go ahead and have it all you like. So you remember when you did the silver stars uh -huh. last episode? You got to do it again. Uh, pretty much the exact same level. Nothing has changed except there's a hundred purple coins all over the place. And timed? No. Oh. Well, this is another one of those. Hey, we're gonna give you a gigantic level, and spray a hundred coins all over the place. Oh, good luck. Have asshole. fun finding all of them. Yeah, good luck, asshole. Mm-hmm. Okay. Well, shouldn't be too bad, should it? Yeah. Yeah, yeah sure. We got two sets of eyes working here, so we can probably figure this out, no problem. Yeah, this it's not a hard level, it's just a long fucking level. It's 
a lot of the problems here. <sighs> Long fucking levels. Long fucking levels. Well, guess we'll start here on Cloud9. Well, the other problem is it relies on the bee suit. Can I pop those? I can! Oh, thanks. I, didn't, I actually didn't know you could do that. And there's... Oh, Lord. There's one. Mm -hmm. And then do it over They're here. They're everywhere. Very get the and next it takes one. so far. And guess how many coins there are? Too many. Exactly 100. Exactly so you have to get every uh, single uh, one. Uh, I wonder why people call this uh, the not fun part of the game. I don't know what they're talking about. Mm. I got my controllers. Your, go. your controller's doing something weird. It's, it's either the sensor bar or your Wiimote. No, it's the sensor bar, man. Because, you know, I sit, I sit over there and it's fine, no mm -hmm. matter what controller I use. Correct. I'm over here, it's all fucked up. Fucked. Is it, is it because of where my... I think it's how my uh, pop filter, my stand is positioned. Probably, yeah, it's cutting off the signal. Yeah, probably. I think I'm figuring the signal would be stronger than that, though, you think. You'd think, but don't you have a third-party sensor bar? Or no, get a new no, one? that's the one from the, from the Wii U. Oh. Hmm. I don't know, you, you have technical issues. Uh, about as frequently as I do. Oh, that's life, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, B-Mario is too weak to bust a box. So forget. That I didn't know. I might as well get those three now, and are there any on the other side? Uh, no, I think there's some above it, though. Uh, oh, oh, look at that! No losing the bee suit it doesn't matter, because there's one right there. You stepped on damp ground, buddy. Mm-hmm. Damp ground. Yeah, bees are good with damps. As they are with dabs. That was my attempt at humor to appeal to the kid audience that is clearly watching this. That was an okay attempt, I suppose. Yes. All I have to do is say, dabbing, fidget spinner, all those things that people know and love and remember. You know, there's a bin of fidget spinners at the, at the grocery store <laughs> that has just been sitting yeah, with unsold that fidget fat is spinners. That so dead. It just, lasted just for a good hot minute. Nev I have one. One fidget spinner. And I got it from a store that doesn't normally sell stuff, that usually sells, like, you know, dumb little gifts and stuff like that. I got mine from a white elephant exchange. I, I should have traded. I you should have traded. traded. Damn it. I want one of those fidget cubes instead, they're way fancier. They are cool! I will admit, fidget cubes. Yes. The, best. the spinners, though, they just have limited use. Like, you spin it once and there you go, that's it? You get the spin, well, you can maybe, uh have variations of that spin, you know, every so often, but it's mostly just the one spinning. I thought they were pointing. For some reason, I thought they were pointing. Anyway. There's none up there at the top of the lighthouse, is there? Oh, yeah, there are. They all over the place. All over the place? Yeah, I really wish I didn't can my bee suit, but it's a... Oh, there they are! Uh -huh. I really wish I didn't can your bee suit. Yeah, I'll be fine. Because... Can you jump up and get them? Jump man should be able to... Yep, he can. Excellent. Thank look, you, Mario. Look at that jumping fellow. I love it when Mario does the jump man. Yes! Do the jump man! Do the jump man! Do you, think, do you think when the paparazzi comes around and says, Hey, it's Mario! Do the jump man! Okay. And then he tried to disguise himself as jump man in Donkey Kong, but it didn't work out. Mm -mm. Tabloids were all over they that. They knew it was him. Mm -hmm. Production leaked early. Well, oh, God. It's so terrible. I'm not even halfway done. Nope, we're getting there. Yes, it worked. Okay. It helped. A little stagger trick I found out from a speed run I watched. Because they know what they're doing. And we don't. No, we know no. everything about this game. Oh, yeah, everything. I Absolutely. Have, I have the guide, man. Oh, yeah, and how well has that guide been helping out with this uh, playthrough here? Uh, not a whole lot, because we're good. <laughs> yes, exactly. See, that's what I don't get. Why would you get a Prima Guide for a Mario game? One of the... Some of the easiest games in the world. Except when, they, you know, they pull this crap, and it's utterly impossible. Maps. Yeah, I can I guess maps. Can you imagine the Prima Guide for uh, Breath of the Wild? If it ever exists? Actually... I have it. How big's the map? Well... Oh, good lord, there he goes. You don't get it. Guide itself. How big is that monster? I mean, this, this is a big fucking guide, it's thick. It's a thick book. 
Ike. Not the, oh, that looks cool. Not the thickest guy I have that belongs to Skyrim, but yeah. here's, here's the map. Right here, unfolds once, twice, thrice, <laughs> and then it opens the other way once. Oh my god. Yeah, yeah, it's double-sided. One side has all the locations of the shrines on it, and a couple of other, you know, some stables and some temples. The other side is a very, very loose idea as to where all the Korok seeds are. And there's a little addendum over here filled with things you gotta do for the more difficult ones, you know, pinpointing exactly where the thing is. Mm -hmm. It's it's very in-depth and very thorough. So that's how you found all the shrines, is you cheated. Exactly, yes. Instead of, you know, going for the, the grand adventure, people keep trying to convince me that's what Breath of the Wild is about, but, uh... I don't really care. Well, you're just bad at it. You never, you haven't been outside enough to appreciate nature, so you wouldn't appreciate a nature game. You didn't play mm. Okami. No, I didn't. Even though I own like three versions. Of you it. didn't play Skyrim. Uh, yeah, yeah, you're right. I didn't. You don't, you don't know about. You didn't play Dark Souls. You don't know about the exploration of a map. What do you care about? I really don't. Know. <laughs> yeah. I mean, all I know is there's Persona, and oh, that's about it. Nah, that's about, that's about all I need. Stay in with my, uh... <laughs> oh, well, what do I want to call that? I, I want to say anti-social simulator, but that's not true. You're <laughs> very social in that game. Up! Oh! Hey. Oh. Go on, bee suit. Go on, you crazy beeman. Alright, 67 coins. I hope this is right. Yeah, we should be right. I don't think I've missed any at this point. Hope not. Eh, uh, should be fine. Maybe. And if I do... That gives you extra stuff to cut out later. <laughs> Glorious. So much footage to cut out. That was fantastic. Great. So fantastic. Now I really want to play Skyrim for some reason. I don't know why you don't. I mean... I, I don't think, know either! I think about everyone's played Skyrim at this point. It's just like, I started playing it, and I was like, yeah, this is cool. And then something else came out, and I was like, okay. Something else? Yeah. What the hell something else is there when it comes to Skyrim? Literally anything else. For some reason, it's not grabbing me like Oblivion did. I, I don't know. It's better than Oblivion. Well, I, well, some people might argue that. But from what? a technical standpoint, yeah, it is. There are some things that are better in Skyrim than Oblivion, but... Like, I take a look at Skyrim, I start playing, and I was like, oh, yeah, this is awesome. And then for some reason, I just stop and never come back. I don't get it. You gotta live your own adventure, man. Oh. You gotta stop letting the game tell you what to do. You gotta go on your own sometimes. That's the only way I stay you. with it. I loved when Oblivion told me what to do. You were you were just an errand boy in that game. I was. You were just a. And it was the only reason I beat it. It's because I was like, yeah, I wanna, I wanna go on this adventure to this one place and deliver the thing. But they give you a whole bunch of quests in Skyrim. Yeah, that's the that's probably the reason I wasn't too fond of Breath of the Wild, <laughs> because I want to be told what to do. I You're can't. a fucking slave to I the am! system. I you are a slave to the system! I can't carve my own path! I just want to be told where to go in the fucking No thing. imagination! No originality! Mm -mm. None of it. Absolutely terrible. That's why you that's why you like games like Persona, because it's all in a calendar what you do. Yep. It's all set in stone. It's all the things I want to do on my daily it's life. Like, oh, I gotta go to school go now. Down a list I gotta and be told what to do. Oh, I just go on the internet. What else did people Oh I couldn't <laughs> I can see. Oh, you gotta go talk to this person. Oh okay. boy, what else did other people do? Let's find out. <laughs> well, now that we found out I'm a boring player, let's find. Uh, oh, wait. I'm gonna make you play a game like that at some point. I'm gonna, I'm gonna oh, find no. the most calming, explorative game. The most vi like like. Let's play Rhyme. We're gonna play fucking Rhyme. I'm good at Minecraft <laughs> because I have things to do. Oh God, I am boring. Give me that last coin. I am boring, he cried as the last star came out. There, we did it. <laughs> oh, God. Now Wally has a moment. I am boring. Go. That's why I'm so good at collectathon games, because I have shit to collect and do. I think we've reached a breakthrough here. Oh, God. Uh, for some reason, I still think Banjo Kazooie sucks, because it does. I had more fun with ukulele than I thought. I hate ukulele, too. I like I like it though because oh, it's obnoxious. when you get to the fifth part of the game, there's a flight mechanic to make it easier. Yeah, you so just, you don't have to do all the monotonous stuff. Just throw fucking Lele in the air and then you take flight. See you later. See, that's bad when the halfway point of the game is finally fun. That's like Final Fantasy 13 bad. No, that's that wasn't the halfway point. It was actually the last level. <laughs> that sounds 
it's worse! Oh man. But they but they did a patch that made, a, made it a hell of a lot better. The camera's better, they changed the voice acting, so that way it just goes like a little bit and then it stops. Well, good job, uh, Platonic. You, you made your game not as annoying. God damn it, speaking I, of annoying. I see Platonic as more of an indie crowd. I mean, I'm sure what they did is a hell of a lot better than what Rare would have ended up doing. If Sea of Thieves is to be believed. Sea of Thieves is boring as fuck. No man's ocean. No, oh, no, there's actually stuff to do in Sea of Thieves, I'll at least give it that. This, but this as soon as you find the ten things that you're able to do, that's it. Sorry, Rare, you just you just can't you can't sell me on a game that's half done. You can't cut it. So get, get on a cloud, maybe. There we go. There you go. There, finally, Jesus. I was having so much trouble. I'm sorry. That's, that's I'm so quite, sorry. Yeah, yeah, I hope you are, but for people who love big explorative games, I'm so sorry. Apologize to bee lovers everywhere. <laughs> Bees, I'm sorry. Mean it. <laughs> I can't. I can't mean it. I am my own person! How the hell did you miss that? God... Please, thank you. There, now my therapy session is done. Therapy <laughs> session. <laughs> B for boring? Yeah, that level sucked. Anyway. What else we got? I swear there's one more in there. Or maybe that's it. Well, let's no, see. It. Galaxy complete, so... What else we got? Let's, let's, let's find out. Let's, Dink. let's dry our tears. Build, 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 oh, God, there's yeah, two. Yeah, see, there's two of them, and I know exactly what they are, so I'm going to let you take care of those. Oh, you're <laughs> such a good friend. Yeah, I love it. Now, uh, where, where can we go next? Let's go to the hard levels. Finally. Okay, go to the garden. Oh, fuck. I know what's there. I take care of one there. more while we're here. Oh, I know what's there. Oh, oh. Well, fine. I'll take that. I don't wanna, but it's got to be done eventually. So you know how bad Daredevil comments are, right? Yes. No one health and you die. Uh huh. Now, somebody had the amazing idea, and just think, this is somebody from Nintendo, people who supposedly had good have good ideas all the time. What happens if we take one of the levels that is the hardest to do, and have you go through the entire level again with one health? That's one of the prankster comets in Melty Molten Galaxy. You're saving that for me, aren't you? Do it. <laughs> well, let's just see how this goes. I'm just, you know, one step at a time. Like, oh, <laughs> my God. <laughs> well. Oh, joy. Oh, <laughs> Let's do it. It's my favorite galaxy. My favorite, Ren. It's let's called go. Melty Melty Hot Hot. <laughs> Oh, Lord. And now for the puzzle. Yeah, uh, the camera. The uh, camera's really bad in Melty Molten Galaxy. As uh, I found out. I find out the hard way that some of these levels aren't really good because of the camera, especially this one. Well, wouldn't you want to love that second stick that a GameCube controller could offer? Hmm, maybe. Or, you know, not a restricted camera where you can only use it when the game feels like it. See, look, I can't move the camera. <laughs> <laughs> I thought that would work. I don't think that's the right move, buddy. I know, but don't, it, don't think it so. Don't. Worked. There's a separate gravity. Come well, on, like, dude. Right we only there. have we only have 45 lives left. I need oh, you to step no. it up. God. I need you to step it up. Ahem. Yeah. So those are properly placed to hit you into the uh, dead. Yep. Okay. Ahem. So anyway, first try. Yeah. Uh, that's alright, that's first try. Indeed. No, no, not gonna fall no, for no. it again. That was a beginner's trap, you are no longer a beginner. I am the master of Mario Galaxy. Eh. Oh. 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 Yeah. We'll go with Journey, man. <laughs> oh yeah, I hate Journey too. Journey's a terrible game. Because you're not told what to do when it's obvious what you're supposed to do. <laughs> Go to the fucking shiny mountain. I also, What's not to get about that? I also think it's more style than substance. <laughs> There's nothing to it. Because you don't pay the fuck attention when you play <laughs> video games. I do. 
I pay the fuck attention. I just. Well, how, how can you say you pay attention to video games? You think that you know, there's no substance to Journey? Because you barely do anything in it. You're going on a journey. Well, there's the problem. I'm going on a journey. You're, with no you're rhyme going or on a journey. You're sitting there in the sand. You wake up. You look there, the title appears with uh -oh. the fucking mountain in the background, and you go, gee, I wonder where I should go. I don't know, because where you look, there's a fucking mountain, so why don't you go to the mountain? What more do you So do, all I do, do is just do, travel? Do you, go, do you need someone to go, young traveler, you must venture to the tallest mountain that lies at the edge of the desert in order help. to find your true destiny. It would help! <laughs> it's right there! It's right there! There in front of your fucking face. So really, I'm just walking from point A to point B. That sounds like such a fantastic game. What's well, about the journey, not the destination? But I don't That's care why it's about called the journey. journey. I want to be doing something besides walking to a bunch of rocks. Okay, you want? Uh, all right, you want stuff to do? You're gonna glide through the, this wonderful sand slide with all these you know birds and shit following you. Ooh, you're gonna go. Cool. You're gonna Let go me go grab my camera. A, you're gonna go into a deep dark cave Ooh, where you see that sounds that great. Yes, it is great because it's a wonderful cinematic environmental experience oh, that for some God. reason you can't figure out because I don't know what to do. Look around you! Use your eyes! Oh, look at all that scenery that I can only look at and not do anything with. Wow, what a fantastic Well, have you tried game. going there, maybe? You look yeah, around yeah, in the yeah, desert yeah. when you see a little house in the distance. You really think that's there by accident? Well, I'll just try fucking going there. Oh, a maybe desert you'll level? Find, maybe you'll find a flower reference or something from their previous game, huh? Oh, yeah, that was a fun game, too. Look, I'm flower petals. God damn it! Well, uh, okay, I, I, I gotta grab that. That was a little, uh... <laughs> it, it was an attempt. It was, it, uh, I'll, I'll give him that one. It's supposed to be more zen, but I thought I was like, you know, all right, I'm, I'm flower petals flying around. It's, it's kind of relaxing, I guess, but if I want to relax, I can just listen to some good music. That I is a good point, yeah. good, but, but, but still, Journey is a fucking I, I memorable say, experience. Journey's got great music. It's boring as fuck to play. Because you haven't lived it yet. I haven't lived it. Uh-huh. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Okay, good. That was almost bad. Yeah, that was almost absolutely terrible. Boom! By the way, you know I'm saying it's this. It's like saying you read a book, it's like, I didn't like this book. Too many too many words. <laughs> no, it's not. If I'm playing a game, I want to actually be doing something besides taking in scenery. Uh-oh. How about dying? <laughs> I'll do plenty of that. <laughs> do you, have, you haven't even gotten to the best part when you're going along and all of a sudden a random player just appears next to you. Whoa! Somebody else going on the journey with you, and you're on there, and you got this way of- ah! <laughs> You have this unique way of communicating when you press the circle button, just, you know, hub, hub, fucking whatever with your own unique symbols, and you guys can talk to each other in a very rudimentary sort of way, and it's very organic and it's nice, and. Whoa! But nope, I don't know what to do, so. No, I never said I didn't know what to do, it's just I didn't give a shit. Because <laughs> I take one look at that and it looks so boring. You need to care more. It looks so boring, though. <laughs> yeah. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh -oh. Well, hey, that's not Ooh. three parts. It's way easier than the challenge star. I'm gonna dupe journey just to piss you off one of these days. You know I only said that stuff just to piss you off, right? Well, it worked. Yeah, it did. <laughs> <laughs> I knew I could keep you going, because really nothing's happening in these galaxies, let me tell you. Hey, but we did it. We did, we did Yay, do it. Yay, more got, stars. It got done did. Hooray. Now, how, uh, how much closer are we to that big old 120? Well, we haven't hit the big 100 yet, so... It's like, what, 92, perhaps? 95? No, not that much. Really? 94. Oh, 94. 94. Oh, split the difference. All right. All righty. You can either have the rest of Melty Molten Galaxy or leave it for me. Well, I'll see what comments are in the place next time on Let's Play Super Mario Galaxy. Sweet. Sweet.